Drum, Philly Film, Drum, Games, Drum. It's over. Welcome to the Pleasure Dome. <laughs> You're just gonna walk up I'm like just a. Gonna strut I'm, my way over. Uh, I'm accepting my fate now. God damn it! Hey, bitches. <laughs> I did not know that. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> run away! Run away! Oh, there goes. Who's that? That that was uh, Charla. Oh, Charla took a dive. So this is this is turning into one of those classic. Um, I only saw them in WCW back in the day. They had a they had a wrestling match where there was like a. Th- they were ladders, but there was a. Br- I think it was called a bridge match. Yeah. So what they would do is about ten feet above the ring. Uh, there would be they have these ladders go up on opposite wow. end, opposite ends of the ring. You're dead. Wow. Well, he those guys toppled the whole team. Uh huh. And then just pummeled me and. Oh, Charlotte man. into the ground. Wow. But they would, they would, uh, they had this bridge, which was essentially a ladder of some sort that would span across the, the ring. Mm-hmm. And the deal was, if you fell off the bridge, you lost. Okay. And, uh, yeah, that's not gonna happen. Jesus. That's all you can say is sorry, Shulk. How about you done fucked up now? Yeah. Anything like that, you maniac? Um. Oh, there goes your treasure! Yeah, but that's from, like, when I killed the one that fell in there. Oh. But uh, he respawned because I didn't kill everything. Oh, I shit. Lost. Damn. So, uh, you wanna do this again? Like, Charla, move your ass! Yeah. This, this is not good. Like, at all. But, I don't, I, I mean, I rarely ever saw those matches, and I did see one live. Like, when I was eight. Yeah. And, uh, it was pretty wild. Like, I remember they were hanging from the damn thing underneath it and whatnot, ha- conducting this match. I don't remember who... I don't remember who was in it, but I just remember seeing that match. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, one fell in. But, uh, yeah, it was it was pretty wild that that was, that was a thing that they were... that they would do. Good old bridge matches. They had a lot. Of, some of the gimmick matches back in the day were straight up weird. Like they had, um, I think it was called a cowbell match, <laughs> where you had, um, you were you were tied to your opponent, and oh, it was just fucking weird. You you could, uh, the thing that you were tied to it was a bit of rope. And there was a cowbell on it, mm-hmm. and you could actually use the cowbell on, like, actually bonk your head, your opponent in the head with a cowbell. I don't know what the fuck it was for, but that's just what they did. Yeah, why not? I mean, matches back, well, matches are still jacked up, but yeah, back in the '80s, man, like the <laughs> the weird gimmicky match shit was the just, anything. Yeah, the anything goes matches. <laughs> yeah. Can I just get like one of you guys to come with me? Ryan, go up there and just there you go. There, there, okay. Run away! Show, don't fall in the fucking water. <laughs> don't fall in the fluoride again. Yeah, avoid the green stuff. We'll be fine. But, uh... God, yeah. Uh, well, now that I got wrestling on my mind, I found out something. Um, apparently, the Ultimate Warrior... Raped Santa twice. <laughs> Once in a in a actual um live action shoot. Don't ask me how. Yeah, was, <laughs> and the other one was in one of, in the Ultimate Warrior comic books, which also exists. So he, he raped Santa Claus because you know why Cause, the fuck wouldn't you? Yeah, because. It's an option, it's a possibility, it's like, when am I ever going to do this again? Warrior wants to see you move like a bowl full of jelly. Yeah. Bye, oh, Charla. Yeah, there she goes. Bloop. <laughs> I'm going skinny dipping, boys. <laughs> Meanwhile, they just don't even care, because they're just... Oh, oh, I'm glad to see you came back. Yeah, she teleports back, I guess. 
Yeah, they, they, yeah they, don't heal yourself, Charlotte. It's okay. You can stay at no health. Yeah. Yeah, you'll be fine I at don't one. Mind. Not at all. Totally got this by the balls. Nice. Yeah, almost too easy. Cause you went for a fucking swim. Yeah. You fuck maniac. God damn it. Watch me. Whoop. Yeah. I'm just gonna save before I take on the big guy. Yeah, cause you watch. You die at this, and they're all gonna be back. They will be back. Oh, that's right. So this is your. This is gonna be my load point if this goes poorly. Nice. I didn't know that Shulk had a, uh, not Shulk, but Ryan had a raccoon tail. I just noticed that. It's a recent addition. <laughs> it's a recent. It's, he, he, he killed Mario and took part of his tanuki suit. Yep. It's his now. Oh, damn. Okay, Charlie, you're still up here. Suddenly you, like, floated to the side. I'm like, did she just fall? No! I can't afford you to... I mean... Three's not too bad, but... I, th I think... I, I have faith in you. Because... You're Eric. And you're you're amazing. Because you're good enough. You're smart <laughs> enough. And doggone it, people like you. People. I showed that to my, uh... My students prior to their, uh... Uh, their first graded speeches because yeah. none of them had ever heard it like was, when I said that line I'm like alright before we get into speeches we're going to watch this show I showed them the one when they had uh, Michael Jordan on yeah and he was say, he had to say in the mirror I may not be the best basketball player in the world and you know he can't fucking say that with a yeah, straight it's face just like how is <laughs> yeah, so yeah I, we watched that uh Prior to the their graded speeches, yeah, I've been I've been uh, really fucking with them as of late because I decided like this this semester since I basically have senioritis, uh, I decided to change up the midterm. Yeah. So it basically became an episode of whose line is it anyway? And uh, <laughs> bye, boon. <laughs> Oh, you! Oh, is this how you're gonna break the, break the, the, the future? With a sack tap, toppled him. Yes. Uh, this is usually your heel, right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it's usually what you've done, did. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, you, oh nope, you still gotta. He's still toppled. Okay. Boom. Oh, so it did. It did break his. I've fallen, and I can't get up! Oh, I love that commercial. God. Break your hand number four. Oh, boom! Whoa, damn. I honestly don't care if Ryan takes that one to the teeth. It's not that... It's It's not even a... It's like a fourth of his health. Oh. He's got plenty left after that. Uh, bye, Ryan. Kaboom! Until he's thrown into the fucking yeah, ether totally lake. Bloops into that, then that would not be so good anymore. Ryan, now fortified with, <laughs> with fluoride. Or ecto cooler. Hmm. One of the two. I think I'd prefer ecto cooler. Oh. No, oh, Ryan! Go down there with him, you jackass! Chase him! You're. Ah, fuck. You're really getting into this ride. Yeah, he's swimming. I mean, he's loving it. Yeah, he's totally into it, man. Uh, there. Ryan came back up here just so he could die. Good for him. I'm going to revive him. Uh, uh, I'm, oh, glad you know. I'm glad you're back. Now, uh, could you not fucking take a dive again? This isn't a boxing match, you asshole. But yeah. What's this now? Auto chainsaw. That'll knock you silly. But, uh, so what we did was we had no, uh, whose line is it anyway, and I should have brought, I should have brought some of the crazy-ass questions that I've used, mm -hmm. because I, I had, like, what, I had six scenarios. Uh, one was a job interview, one was, uh, one was a, uh, I was screening some private detectives to help me find my, my, my lost echidna knuckles. Nice. Um... Uh, 
One was a presidential debate. Oh, fuck, Shulk, don't you dare fall. Yeah, we, we will be at odds if you fall. Hurry up, revive high pants. Well, you're, you're oh. down. Now it's up to Ryan. Oh, well. But the <sighs> gauge isn't big enough to bring Oh, uh, damn. All right. Well, you know what? That's what I'm wouldn't. Not... <laughs> Wait, are you... Because I saved right before when they were all dead. R right. The checkpoint is when I just reached that area. Oh. Uh, I was going to say this. No, it's not. They're all back. So I'm going to pause this now. And Damn. we're gonna get through this, so pausing. Oh. <laughs> game won't even let me do that. I can't even get the the dignity of of getting through this shit. All right, bitches. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> wow, the so the sass is coming through hardcore there now. Go. There you go, Charlotte. Fuck you. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Oh, look, there's that treasure chest over there. Uh, oh, and we're all toppled. We're off to a stellar start. <laughs> get up. Get up. Let's get ready to rumble! Here we are. Again. I was about to say, we're Charla. But, yeah, we're back and taking on uh, Johnny55. Johnny55 alive! Oh. Oh, short circuit. Especially Short Circuit 2. You always made me laugh. I did not realize when I used to watch that movie all the time when I was younger mm -hmm. that the, 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 especially the, the first movie, the girl that, uh, jo uh, Johnny Five meets is the same girl from fucking, uh, Breakfast Club. The Misfit. Really? Yeah. It's her. Hi. I, I had no clue. I was say, I... Nope, I wouldn't have guessed that. Yeah. Yeah, she and the one from the Breakfast Club that uh, made snowflakes with dandruff. Yeah. <laughs> were <laughs> the same person. That. Like, oh shit. Wow, you have quite the acting range. Yep. <laughs> uh, but to get back to what I was saying about screwing. Not over yet. We're boning this oh, guy. Yes, we're straight up boning. Oh wait, are you on your second... Um, yeah, too bad it's like, I have to break the chain with the heel. Oh. I don't... Do I get to keep going? Yes! Wow! Yes! Fuck this guy up! <laughs> <laughs> he is not getting up! <laughs> you will not! You shall not pass! <laughs> Alright, that was all he gave me. <laughs> but, but he's back down, who gives a shit? Yeah, he's still toppled, so I'm gonna daze him some more. <laughs> Put him ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Braveheart didn't get this kind of treatment at the end of the movie. <laughs> <laughs> but we, uh... I ha so, I had these those scenarios. Um, and, like, I dug up some, like... So oh, did he... F oh, no, he didn't. Um, I'd honestly be kind of mad if he fell. Mainly because I have a feeling he's going to drop a really big treasure chest. <laughs> yeah, that would be bad. Uh, so I found all these crazy ass questions yeah. from from beauty contests and job interviews and shit like that. Yeah. And I I implemented them into the into the thing. So like they had no clue what scenario they were gonna be in or what the hell was going on. It was just like I'm gonna you know we're gonna do I'm this. I'm gonna thing. throw some shit at you and we're gonna get it done. Here we go. Yeah. Right. <laughs> that's exactly what it was because I'm like I want you guys to have fun and the reason why I'm doing this is because. I want, I want, I want you to be able to, you know, be able to think on your feet in case, you know, there will be times when shit just doesn't work for you. Mm -hmm. So you got to be able to at least improvise something while you're up there. Yep, you're gonna have to wing it. <laughs> yeah. So, um, so I was asking like some, some of the some of the, some of these questions were like really, like, out there at points. Uh, one that I one that I liked was like, like for the private detectives, I asked them. Uh, can you see why kids love to taste the cinnamon toast crunch? <laughs> they were like, the one was that was one of my uh, international students. He's like, I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. And you're like, oh damn. <laughs> well, <laughs> too bad. You're gonna have to figure it out. <laughs> uh, I asked one of my presidential candidates, um, 
in 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 uh, recent speeches, you have said that the rum is all gone. Can you please explain why the rum is all gone? <laughs> why is the rum gone? <laughs> <laughs> um, one of the beauty co- contestant questions was, um, uh, describe a pizza and how you are like every topping. <laughs> <laughs> the guy the guy that had it mm-hmm. was like um oh a knuckle driver yeah I'll try that in bed sometime uh, never no man nah. <laughs> the knuckle driver <laughs> not going there <laughs> no uh he was like hey, what did he say uh he talked about the crust and then he talked about um how he's Italian, so he's not cheesy. There's no cheese. Mm-hmm. And I have pepperoni because I'm spicy that way. And I'm like, oh, God. <laughs> and you're like, uh. uh. <laughs> it's terrible. But okay, you answered. <laughs> yeah, you did. Uh, I had, like, some of the others were, um. Oh, in the presidential debate, I asked, uh. Your your competitors accuse you of of knowing the Muffin Man of Drury Lane. How how, <laughs> how does how does this association with Big Bakery affect, affect the uh, could, could impact the uh, the opinions of the voters? Yeah, tell me now. <laughs> Just like totally fucking with them. One of them I asked. Uh, you you. Uh, as your tenure as mayor of Detroit, you've stated that Detroit needs RoboCop, which you did make a reality. Would you extend this into uh, making this a nat- national-wide program? Oh, boy. I can't I hope his answer was yes. She she actually said no. Aw. So, is that... It's some dude. Spear ones. Lord and Lord of Spear Lickon. Oh. They're fans of Aquaman. Yeah. Because, you know, Aquaman. That's a game I need to get, is Aquaman on GameCube. Oh, it's her again. Are you... Oh, balls. Yes, this, this be bad. <laughs> this doesn't look good. No, it does not. So next time on Philly Film Games... Oh, fuck. Or, or, yes, exactly. <laughs> That's a good with, way to end it. Oh, God, without her getting hurt? Good luck. <laughs>